fucking nuts. <laughs> everybody it's me JJ the killer doll here and I figured I would give you guys a little glimpse into the future of killer doll creations throughout this video I'll be playing Saints Row 3 because I don't have the money to afford Saints Row 4 <sighs> Sad face. Now, right now we have two pretty big things going on we have man assassin hunter that fucker in the limo hit me Man Assassin Hunter involving Connor Kenway, you know, that Native American, Australian, Scottish, whatever funny accent I decided to give him at the time of recording guy. Then we also have the 1989 arcade classic Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah, that game. You know, I have three episodes of the Man Assassin Hunter, two episodes of the Let's Play. Don't forget to check those out. Maybe after you're done watching this video, maybe you came from those videos. I don't know. Whatever floats your boat. Also, as I said, this video is about the future. So, I'll tell you what's in the future. Grand Theft Auto 5, WWE 2K14, and Assassin's Creed 4. What do these three games have in common? At least all of them will be have a video made of them. Dun, dun, dun! Dun 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 dun. It'll probably be starting with Grand Theft Auto V, considering that comes out next month, I think. Yeah, September. So there'll probably be a video on that. I'll probably give my review of it. Don't expect a high rating. I mean, I for me personally, I didn't like Grand Theft Auto IV, but I'll cover that in my review for Grand Theft Auto V. Also, Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag. You play as a pirate and an assassin. Excuse me why I do a high-pitched girl scream. I'm not really going to do a high-pitched girl scream because it's almost 3 in the morning. But I am extremely excited for that. Because, you know, pirates, assassins, same freaking game. Yes, please! Last year I did a countdown for WWE 13 and I figured I'd reuse that concept. Only this time I'll make a countdown to Assassin's Creed 4. One day I'll play the first Assassin's Creed, then I'll play Assassin's Creed 2, then I'll play Brotherhood, then Revelations, and then I'll finish it up with Assassin's Creed 3, and on the last day I'll make a quick run through of Assassin's Creed 4. Well, not quick, because, you know, it's supposed to be an oak and I'm just running over people, speaking about running through. Also, WWE 2K14. I'll probably do a match for you guys and let you know what updates I've noticed, what things I liked, what I wished was in it, what I wish they didn't put in it. Because I already know there's going to be a few things that are like, man, why did they put this in the game? No one's even going to use it. Oh, only I don't think I'm going to sound like that when I do it. I think that was just a spur of the moment off the top of my head thing. Speaking about things off the top of my head, I looked at my subscribers the other day and realized I'm halfway to 100! Yay! It might not sound like a big deal to you guys, but it's a pretty big deal to me. I, I've been doing this for a while, and to get as far as I've gone, it makes me pretty happy. So I figured if I can at least get, you know, like 60 subscribers or something, I'll do a live stream. I'll play whatever I pick up, I'll talk about whatever comes off the top of my head. It'll be JJ the Killer Doll and all of his raw, uncensored, unrecorded, edited glory. It'll just be uh, diarrhea of the mouth, as gross as that sounds. Uh, trust me, it'll be an experience for the ages. And ages of... Oh, I own... Oh, dear, he did blow up. I was going to say, I think I just sandwiched that guy between the truck and my car. Which, by the way, isn't my car extremely amazing? Look at that. It's so hetero. It's so manly. You know, it's pink and it's black. It's got gold rims. It's actually kind of sexy. I would totally get into cars for this car. I'd be like, hey, how you doing? Can I honk your horn? 
Oh, that's the nitrous button. Apparently, I got it a little too excited. Also, <clears throat> changing the awkward subject, I have a secret let's play. Ooh, mystery! Involved. It could be Mass Effect. Could be Halo Reach. Could be Kayla Duty. Who knows? Or it could be something completely terrible. Like Happy Go Lucky or something for the Kinect. I don't know. It, it definitely won't be a Kinect game. Definitely not. Forget the Kinect. But I'm sure you guys will like it regardless what game I pick because I'll make anything funny. Like Sarah Jessica Parker. Ouch. <clears throat> anyway, I also have in store a co-op plan. The game that we'll be playing in the co-op is Lego Indiana Jones, because who doesn't love Lego games? Who doesn't love Indiana Jones? Who doesn't love co-ops? Who doesn't love love? I guess to make this who doesn't love joke go on longer. Who doesn't love jumps? Everybody loves jumps. I think it's like the same jump I've taken like four times now. But yeah, I'm going to be working with somebody that I've already worked with once before. Zach is a pretty great guy, Mr. Travis e. Tales. I'm sure you guys have heard of him. I'll put his link in the description so that way you guys can check him out. So you can be like, oh man, these guys are pretty amazing. I can't wait until they work together. But uh, yeah, it'll be fun and tons of bunches for all of that stuff. Oh, that didn't work out the way I wanted to. I don't really know what I was planning on that, but I just know it wasn't supposed to come out like that. Also, I have this weird idea of a fan-suggested video thing. Could be a Let's Play, could just be a random update, could be a full-on walkthrough. Who knows? I just need suggestions from you guys. Just keep in mind that I am poor, I only have an Xbox, and I'm open to try anything once. Once. <laughs> so, like, if you guys see a game and it's like, oh man, I bet that JJ would be terrible at this game, let me know. Tweet me. Leave me a message on Facebook. Just leave a comment in the video and be like, hey, I bet you would do fantastic in FIFA 14. I'd be like, you're wrong, but I'll try it. So, yeah, just kind of keep the price at about a $30 minimum, and, uh, and we'll see what we can do with that. But, um, uh, yeah, I think that's going to wrap it up for this video. I'd like to thank you guys for uh, sitting through another one of my extremely boring updates as I plow through this guy. I'm going to go ahead and end this video with a bang here. Grab this thing, and now we're going to go and use this thing. Until next time, I am JJ the Killer Doll. You are my faithful audience who do all that amazing old YouTube stuff that you can't do anymore, reminding you to never be normal! Explosion!